the one, the only, Ben Sion. Good evening and welcome to Yeshiva YouTube <clears throat> Daily Double. Today we're doing Maseches Yuma, Perek Aleph, Mishnah Zvav and Zion. Mishnah Zvav says, Yimayat Chacham, let's talk about the night of the of Yom Kippur. The Kohen Gadol was not allowed to fall asleep. They didn't want him to fall asleep because he fell asleep. He might see Kerry, he might see semen, and he might become Tomei for Avodah Shem Lakipurim. So they wanted to keep him up. So if he was a Chacham, a Dorish, he would, <clears throat> he would expound on the Torah. If he wasn't, so then other Tamir Chamim who used to know how to expound in the Torah, you get Rechaim Brisker to teach him analytically how to learn, they would do that. <clears throat> However, if he was someone that wasn't engaging in Pilpul, in Drusha, he was someone that was more intent on learning Tanakh. So Kore, he would read himself. If he didn't know how to do that, people would do it for him. But Mac Karan Lafana, what would they read for him? But Eob Ezra would read Yamim. These were Sparim that have a story, a plot line. So it was more interesting for the person who would stay alive. Zachari ben Kavuta, Omer Pamim Harbek, Karis Lafana of Daniel. Many times he himself read for the Kohen God of Daniel, which also has interesting stories. Zion, Bikesh Lis Namnim, if the Kohen God wanted to fall asleep, it's always a falling asleep. Pirche Kahuna, they had young Kohanim there, Makin Lafana of Ezra Sreda. And there we go, like this, according to some opinions, or like this. I think this is most opinions like that. They say, go put one foot on the marble tiled floor of the base on Migdash. It'll be cold. And he would wake up. They would basically try to engage him in any way possible. He shouldn't fall asleep until the time came for the shechting of the Tamid in the, in the morning. That's the conclusion of today's year. Stay tuned for Ian. Meet Sion, where I talk about Mishnah Vav. Um, I don't understand. Is it, is the Kohen Gadol supposed to do Drasha? Is he supposed to do Kriya? What are there are different types of Kohanim Gadolim. Does it matter what you want, what not? We'll talk about that. Ian Mitzion coming up next.